Recovering Colorado, even if that means traveling out of Colorado, our Dominic Garcia was invited to the East Coast to board the USS Colorado and meet the local sailors living on that submarine. Hello everyone and welcome to a very chilly Groton, Connecticut. I'm Dominic Garcia and this right here is the crown jewel of the U.S. Navy. This is the newly commissioned USS Colorado and the sailors on board were gracious enough to let us spend a few days with them. Submarines aren't exactly built for people as tall as Paul Nice Wong. Initially, I was like, I don't want to be on a submarine. I don't think there's any place I can stand up straight. <laughs> and, you're, uh, you're barely cutting it right now. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. another Colorado native inspired this one. Sophomore year, I was at Heritage High School where Danny Dietz went. Yeah. So I read Lone Survivor that got me looking into the Navy. It's how he found himself in Groton, Connecticut, on board the USS Colorado. Fairly new to the sub, Paul is working as a food service attendant, something everyone does. It's like the one chance you get where you meet the whole crew. When you're a new guy, it gives you a chance to meet everyone, get to like break the ice, and then you just start to build those bonds. But he's also training on the nuclear side of things in the reactor. More than anyone on board, I was excited to meet Paul because we have a connection. But I know your mom. Yeah. Uh, and she was my second grade teacher. They've got this for you. Oh, wow. So you've got your own little care package. That's cool. Submarine and all. Dear Paul, you're very special. Needless to say, his parents are very proud. You are special. <laughs> it's great brotherhood. It's a small community. We get to know each other very well. And when you see where they live, that might be an understatement. For someone my height, I'm perfectly fine, perfectly comfortable. But we do have some people on board who are six foot four. First class Petty Officer Joseph Gaines showed us the sub six pack. Not a beer, but a bunk where six sailors squeeze in. There's only so much room here, so can you tell someone who might be newer to a sub if they might have a mark on their head or something? Oh, yes, that happens. That definitely does happen. Contact right in your sonar, Gaines 081. Uh, so this is control? 266, surface contact. It's where you drive the ship from. Another Colorado native is Quinlan Craig Melvin. The Arapaho High School grad went to the school mines and wanted to work in the nuclear industry, so he found a home on board the Colorado, helping make sure the most advanced sub in the world is ready to go. We'll do a lot of training, make sure that we can certify our teams to go and take the fight to the enemy, whether that's anti-submarine warfare, so making sure that we can track other submerged contacts from other nations, anti-service warfare, being able to identify and locate their surface ships, follow them, track them, or intelligence surveillance reconnaissance. And would you believe that the periscope on board this state-of-the-art sub is controlled yep. by an Xbox controller? Do you play Xbox as a kid? Absolutely. I'm really good at this. So you, like, It's a transferable skill, so you right? So your mom, I told you so. Yeah, exactly. Hey. You're spending a lot of time playing video games. Mom's preparing, preparing. These are Hoover Goober bars, m and cookie bar. These are two men proud of their roots and can feel the love from Colorado. They plan to return the favor by serving proudly on their state's namesake. Thank you, Mom and Dad. I think you guys already know this, but it's probably nice to hear from your kids every once in a while. Uh, you are the reason that I am the man that I am. So the crew of the USS Colorado is busy getting ready for deployment later this year, and we just want to thank the crew for letting us come on board and see what life is like on a submarine, and a special thanks to everyone who shared their story with us. It has truly been an honor. In Groton, Connecticut, Dominic Garcia covering Colorado first. Oh, thank you, Dominic. Now that you've seen who from Colorado is on that sub, tomorrow night at 10, Dominic shows us what is on board that honors all that Colorado is.